Hello YouTube and this is your boy Chris back at it again and today the outside current temperature is 39.4 degrees instead of me taking out the gold wing today I'm gonna give you an inside and up close look at my ultimate gaming PC that I constructed from the ground up I started out using three BenQ 24 inch gaming monitors. For my computer case, I'm using the NZ XT Switch 810. Inside of the case, I installed the Maximus 5 Formula motherboard. It has an 1155 chipset. And for my processor, I'm using the Intel i7. 3770K that's unlocked and overclocked to 4.7 gigahertz. For my memory, I'm using four sticks of Kingston's RAM, a total of 32 gigabytes. And for my graphics cards, I'm using two ASUS GTX 760s running in SLI. I mounted a water block to the back of the processor. And for my power supply, I'm using the EVGA 1300 watt Supernova. I'm using three hard drives and three solid state drives, a total of four terabytes of hard drive space. Most are being liquid cooled using an alpha cool dual stage pump and two 140 millimeter dual radiators. That gives me a grand total of 1500 liters of cooling liquid per hour. And for my keyboard, I'm using the Corsair K90 LED backlit gaming keyboard. And for my mouse, I'm using the Corsair M90 gaming mouse. So what I'm going to do is kind of give you a small demonstration on how it works. Basically, I could run three uh, monitors at one time. I can open up. Uh, Windows Explorer, Firefox, as well as uh, Chrome, and I could run them all simultaneously, or I can just open up different windows uh, off of one browser. As you can see here, I pulled up a web page, Triple X Deadhead. Um, so let's see if I, okay, I'm scrolling eBay that looked like a pretty good sale if you're in the market for a tablet um, I'm gonna move to my left monitor and pull up YouTube and let's see if I could find Super B let's see if we can get his page started okay Okay, that's Super B. If we can change the resolution, raise it up. Man, I love that intro. Uh, so I got Super B running on the left. I have Triple X Deadhead running in the center. I have eBay on the right. Um, and basically, if I want to just um, watch three different pages, I can. Or if I can just open it up and watch one page in particular, I can. Um, that's the beauty of having a three monitor setup. So let me see if I can open up another YouTube page. I am looking for Psycho Cruiser. And let's see if I can find Cycle Cruiser. I hate advertisements. See if we can skip that. Okay, there is Cycle Cruiser. We have Cycle Cruiser, Triple X Deadhead, and Super B all playing simultaneously. no lagging 
no dragging, no hesitation. Just pure power. Now, I have a tablet, but the tablet just don't do it for me. I mean, it's okay. I can take it with me to a hotel if I'm out of town or to work or something like that. Um, if I want to quick reference the internet or a web page. And a tablet is okay. I mean, I don't have any problem with the iPad. Um, you know, a tablet is fine. You know, a lot of people out there love tablets, kind of like Windows 8. Um, my operating system that I'm using on my PC is Windows 7 64-bit. Windows 7 64-bit operating system. But for a lot of you, when you walk into a store like Best Buy or wherever you may buy a computer from, uh, before you can get it home and power it up, the thing is already kind of outdated. And that's the beauty about building your own system is you can add the latest technology without having to change out the whole system. Um, because when they put those systems together for you, um, they're not, they're going to add the cheapest technology that they can put in there, uh, for the most money. So, but anyway, let me start up a game and show you how my Mega Beast performs when I play a video game. I forgot to mention that my sound system is a 300 watt THX certified 5.1 sound system. The game that I'm playing is called Need for Speed Hot Pursuit and it used to be one of my favorite games but you have so many people online that have cheat codes and the game is not fun anymore when you have a lot of people cheating. But anyway, um, I just wanted to give you a quick demonstration of what it looks like um, when I'm playing games on my system and I'll let it play for another minute or so and then I'll move on to the next game. And for some of you, I know it's kind of hard to see the screen because it's moving so fast. Um, it actually shows a lot better uh, in person than it does uh, looking at it through a, uh, a video. So, but that just goes to show you how fast my system is moving. No lagging, uh, no hesitation, uh, no stopping. I mean, just sheer raw power. And like I said earlier, I'm all about power. Power suit, power tie, power steering. Gotta have power. But this game is fixing to come to an end here in about a minute. And the object is to stop the person from running. So I have to stop them by helicopter, uh, spike strips. Uh, I can run into them, you know, by any means necessary. Do not let the assailant get away. And I am closing in on him because I don't plan to let him get away. Actually, I'm playing somebody online, um, and they're pretty good. But I hadn't played this game in a long time. I just turned it on for demonstration purposes. But if you give me about 30 seconds. I will catch him. He's good, but he's not that good. There it is. I stopped him. I rammed him and stopped him. Okay, now I'm moving on to the next game. And this game is called uh, Titanfall. Titanfall uh, is one of the newer games out. It's a very hard game to play. You gotta have a lot of horsepower to run this game. I mean, if you got a game console like an Xbox or a PlayStation, you know, or a Wii or something like that, you can play it. You know, uh, a game co a game console is kind of a a watered down version of my system. I mean, I'm not putting the game consoles down, but for young for young people, um, you know, three or four hundred dollars on a gaming system is, is enough. Um, but for me, I'm all about power. As I said earlier in my video, power steering, power suit, power tie. I'm all about horsepower. Uh, but Titanfall is one of the hardest games to play. 
uh, when you go in the store and buy a uh, PC, they're going to give you about a 200 watt power supply inside your system, maybe 300. But as I said earlier in my video, my power supply is 1300 watts, uh, pushing two GTX 760 graphics cards. So you got to have a lot of power uh, to be able to play these games without lagging and stopping and hesitation. So. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and cut this game off here in about 30 seconds. I just kind of wanted to give you an idea of how all three monitors uh, run simultaneously. Um, so yeah, no lagging, no stopping, no dragging, just sheer raw horsepower. Just like my Gold Wing, my Honda Gold Wing. Yeah. I love the Honda Gold Wing. But, okay, I'm going to go ahead and shut this game down. And I'm going to put in one more game and maybe let it run a couple of minutes. And then I'm going to go ahead and close out this video for the sake of time. Okay, this game is NBA 2K15. Um, as you can see, it really looks almost like a real basketball game. There's the tip. I'm going to run down the court, pull up and launch it. There it is. Um, as you can see, it looks like a, a real basketball game. Um, and as I said earlier, you know, this is some of the things that I like to do when I'm not out riding my gold wing on a day like today when it's, um, you know, below freezing out or uh, when it's real cold out some days I may uh, ride in the cold um, but then again I may just stay in the house and play some video games it just depends on um, you know what I'm doing when I'm not working so that's all I have for you guys I hope you all like this video as I said please subscribe to my YouTube channel leave your comments below whether you like it whether you dislike it what do you think um, and some of your ideas or maybe even some things you want me to talk about okay that's all I have for you guys you all enjoy your Valentine's Day and I will talk to you later see ya
tablet.